Soldier Field in Chicago. Today, the Iowa Hawkeyes take the field, looking for their 12th consecutive season opening victory, which have all come in dominating fashion. They face a Northern Illinois team, which is riding the nation's longest win streak in the FBS at nine in a row. So second down for the Hawkeyes after Vandenberg came out throwing. He is under center this year, and they will rotate a variety of tight ends as Zach Derby goes in motion. First time on the ground, and the carry is a positive one, and an Iowa first down for Damon Bullock. The freshman, uh, pardon me, the sophomore from Mansfield, Texas, Ken Bishop with the stop. Transfers at fullback in front of Bullock on third and short. Leading the way, Bullock's got the first down, past midfield, and he stumbles his way all the way down to the 42-yard line. A pickup of 13 yards for the Hawkeye the running secondary, back. secondary, he should be at top speed. All according to plan for Greg Davis, who scripts the first 10 games, the 10 plays of the game on offense. Bullock again, around a big left side, and that hole opens up for a pickup of nearly 10. Deshaun Durant, 34-yard kick. He hit 70% of his field goals last season. High snap, kick is true, and Meyer gives Iowa the lead on its opening drive, but a big third down stop by the Huskies of Northern Illinois. To the left side, to the end zone, touchdown Huskies, Keith Harris Jr. And action here with Northern Illinois in the lead, and the turf seemingly becoming an issue as this game progresses. No such issues for Damon Bullock, who rips off a nine-yard run about Brunt this time before the Bears' NFL regular season open. Vandenberg rolls out, finds his tight end, and gets a block from another tight end. It's Zach Derby, who is running behind Fedorowicz at the end of the play. this season for the Iowa Hawkeyes. We've seen a lot of turnover in the backfield. Vandenberg wants a throw, lets it go complete, and this is C.J. Fedorowicz. Another play for his tight end and another big gain. John Winky is the holder. And it stays wide. Northern Illinois will get the ball back after a long drive for Iowa. Iowa to extend the drive with a first down. Vandenberg over the middle, caught. Carrying is Keenan Davis, who took a defender with him. That will set up second and one. Vandenberg and Iowa trying to avoid the upset here in what is technically a home game for Northern Illinois, but a lot of black and gold has filed into Soldier Field today. After consecutive timeouts, third and six. Blitz coming. Vandenberg steps up. He will run and pick up the first down against the pressure. What a play by James Vandenberg. A drop back passer who shows off oh, his wheels. Maybe a couple of Hawks were holding. Here's Mike Meyer on to attempt. 29 yarder. And the chip shot is good for Meyer. Keith Harris Jr., the freshman in the game, he has a touchdown. And on the zone, Reed, a swallowed job by big number 99, Joe Gaglione. Draw. Let's distribute the football quickly. Lynch pressure and loss of football covered by Iowa. Gaglione with the pressure knocked it loose. And Carl Davis was able to pounce on the football. This time Carl Davis finds the football instead of one of his own teammates to jump on. And that makes the sideline wearing white happy because those were the best three defensive plays in a row that Iowa has had in this football game. Great pressure from Gaglione on the outside. He gets the forced fumble. And there's the big man, Carl Davis, all 310 pounds, sets up his offense in the red zone inside the 15-yard line. Great effort on the outside by Gaglione. First turnover in this game for Eve. A 22-yard attempt. He is two for three on the afternoon. And this chip shot is good. Iowa has had six oh, possessions. You always have to respect the run of the quarterback. Five wide. Here goes Lynch with that run, and he's got a first down and more to midfield. And Jordan Lynch with the biggest gain of the day. Jordan Lynch takes it all the way. 73-yard sprint for the first-year starters for 125. 
And now he wants to throw. Lynch has two men deep, and he gets blasted from the blind side by Dominic Alves. That's a big shot, and that one hurt, it looked like, from behind. The blind side, you're ready to throw that football. There has to be a clock in your head at some point when you hitch up once, twice. That ball has to be gone because somebody in a white jersey in an angry mood is coming at you. So you have to get rid of that football or tuck the football away and run it. Second and 16 for the Huskies. And that snap skips right past Lynch. He will fall on it at the 14-yard line. Andrew Ness. Down after the flag was picked up. The weather is also picking up here. Here's Martin Manley. He gets a block, and Manley passed midfield, flipped at the 40. First down, Hawkeyes. Empty backfield, five wide. Vandenberg underneath the Martin Manley. He missed a 40-yarder. This would tie Mike Myers high from last year. The junior from Dubuque, Iowa. He's been all the offense for the Hawkeyes today. Trying to play that win. And he cuts it through. That's a beautiful draw. That looked like he took it right down the right side of the fairway <laughs> and brought it back. Bill Mallory was their head coach. He went on to Indiana the next season. And here goes a big run for Bullock, and he carries it for a first down for Iowa. That's an eight. Ten running backs have gone through, either leaving the program or tearing their ACLs. And now straight up the middle goes Bullock. He's got a first down, and Iowa in business. Play. So the Hawkeyes, with three timeouts remaining, will put this game in the hands of their defense. Perez Ashford will let it drop behind them, and the Hawkeyes down it at the inside the one. Greg Castillo with the hustle. Well, so is everyone else on the offensive line for Northern Illinois. To the goal line, and he didn't get out. Iowa backs him up. Alvis and Hitchens, they say he just got out of the end zone, and so it'll be just outside of the, the track line. Micah Hyde comes up to take it at the 34. He gets a great burst and take it inside the 35. A 10-yard return after that punt. Connor Gallagher for the Huskies. Third and eight to the running game. Bullock has room, and Iowa first down, and touchdown! Iowa takes the lead on a third down run by Damon Bullock, 22 yards. Tom Damon Bullock looked like he was shot out of a cannon off the left side, 22 yards. That's an awesome job at the point of attack. It looked like C.J. Fedorowicz, the tight end, just pushes out and blocks out on Allen Baxter, and that was the block that springs Bullock into the end zone. The ball on the 24-yard line and get in the end zone. And the ball's loose! Lynch jumps back on top of it. It will be a loss of yardage with under two minutes to go down. Game on the line. Lynch scrambles. Looking to throw. Incomplete. Iowa stands. More the intended receiver. And they needed a Ten. big run off the left side to finally get in the end zone. And Tom, he was the difference in this football game. Consistency, 28 attempts for 141. He's the Verizon player of the game. Well, yeah. Iowa win its 12th straight opener and hand Northern Illinois its first loss in its last 10 games, bringing an end to the longest win streak in the FBS.